Hello everybody and welcome back to Test Drive Unlimited 2. I'm your host Valenfor and in today's episode we're gonna start on the A4 Championship which of course is back in Hawaii. So let's head over there now. And whereabouts is it on the map, I wonder? Um, A4, A4. Here we go. It is up here. And as I said in the previous episode, what we're going to do is we're going to start and uh, do these races, and we're going to either mix and match between this car and the American Muscle that I picked up. Because I'm just a little bit uncertain as to uh, how we're going to do with this car. I don't want to keep failing. The next intersection, turn right. But of course, I also uh, want to keep everybody happy right. as well. Your destination is a half a mile away. Perhaps it just. Uh, just means getting used to the car a little bit. You have reached Whoa! Your destination. Right. Wish me luck. Hey! Hello, everyone! Before each competition, it's important to clear your mind. Mental preparation is the key to success for this caliber of competition. This is my race. There's no way anyone will beat me. Hmm. Doing me. You might want to think about putting your clothes back on, love. Right, okay, so here we go then. Uh, we are going to start with this time trial, and we are going to try this one in the Aston Martin and see how we get on. So keep your fingers crossed that I don't make too many mistakes here. Time is passing by, and we need to hurry up. Let's meet the candidates for this timed challenge. Okay, and we're gonna go for a nice slow. Okay, I didn't want to end up having the wheels spin particularly. So uh, let's uh, let's start here. Our first checkpoint appears to be on that pretty nasty bend coming up here. Luckily, this car's brakes are fairly decent, so let's get around this corner. And head on to checkpoint three. So far, so good. Again, <laughs> as always, I don't want to speak too soon, though. to try and do this without penalty. I know that generally ends up going badly for me when I whenever I say that, but um let's uh let's just do what we can. Okay, so we're already four checkpoints down. Four left. Just keeping an eye on the road here because I don't want to end up coming off or hitting a, a nasty bend without realizing that it's there and losing right okay well we took a, a very small amount of penalty there but um, that's fine it's like it never happened right <laughs> you didn't see it these aren't the penalties you're looking for right okay So here we go, we're coming up on checkpoint 7. So far, no massive... Oh god, that's a horrible bend. So far, no massive issues. We've had a little bit of a penalty. Oh 
gold was slowing down. That's not good. <clears throat> Luckily, this this car has got an amazing balance of top speed, acceleration, and braking. So we should get first on this one. Wow. Okay. Nice. Not too bad. Okay, I'm happy with that so far. So we'll go for Speed Trap next. The speed cameras are on today. Drivers need to find the best route and log the fastest times as they pass them. No, Tess. No, Ryan. <laughs> right, we're going to keep on trucking. We're going to continue straight down. We're going to uh, completely miss checkpoint one for now. And we're going to hit four as fast as we can here. And we're going to head and keep heading down to number five. Then we will swing back around. So, so far, so good. We've hit two checkpoints. We've hit both of them at fairly high rate of knots as well. So let's swing back round and hit two, which hopefully will also allow us to hit three and then back around for one. I know that does mean we're going to end up. Um, we're going to end up potentially missing one. Uh, we'll, we'll see what happens. There's uh, there's two done. Let's follow this road around. Nasty bend here. And we're going to end up meeting the competition on the way through as well, but um, not to worry. If we stay over one side, they should miss us. Okay got through that one slower than the rest that's fine here we go slow down for the bend and pass through this one and that should net us first place it's not brilliant we could do with uh, going back through that last one getting ourselves a better score so that is what we will do. Or at least attempt to do, right? We've got to beat 127. Oh shit, we're now in second. Oh god. Right, okay. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh no! Hell. And uh, only just beaten as well. Okay. We'll take second. We got beaten by um, Stuart, but um, that's okay. He's he's far enough down the the ladder that that's not so much of an issue. Right, let's move on up. We've got this speed race here. Right, let's just check first. Yeah, I think someone's hacked some of these. Look at that. I was rather hoping you could uh, see what the NPCs got, but today? never mind. Who will come out on top in this new high-speed race? Find out next in Solar Crown. Okay. Okay, we're just going to keep heading straight here and hope that there aren't any massive bends. And as always, we're going to aim for getting a thousand, I guess. I suppose that's the best that we can aim for here. Uh, 
that's the general rule of thumb with these anyway. I know we have been off the last couple of times, but never mind. Okay, so how are we doing so far? Wow, okay, we're already up to about 700, so maybe a thousand is a little bit off. Perhaps I should be aiming for 2,000. Because a thousand might not cut it. I don't like the noise that my car's making growling at me there. No, 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 come on. Ah. Okay, so that's that's 2,000 that we have hit. We've got a penalty of two, which is pretty good going. But um, I think that we're going to be shy on this one somehow. Wow, okay, <laughs> we did get first. Wow. Thank Christ for that, eh? Good. Okay. Okay. Good. Good, good, good. Right, let's take a look at these races. What have we got? We've got three races. We've got a, a lap-based race there. Got point-to-point -point there. And a point-to-point -point there. Let's, let's check this one out. It looks like a fairly straight race. We meet again live at Solar Crown with all your favorite drivers. Miami, the Wilder Brothers, Stewart, they're all here. And we're off. Okay, we only have six checkpoints to go here. Stuart is already in the lead in something that's supposed to be slower than these cars, which doesn't really make much sense, but hey ho. Um, judging by how the race looked, it looked like a fairly straight race, but we all know looks can be deceiving. I did have to just slow down there, I didn't end up wanting to leave the road, so... This is quite a hilly area. Right, let's uh, get through here, break for the bend, don't spin out. There we go. So yeah, these races, you can't just leave your finger on the accelerator here. You have to control yourself through the bends by just letting off slightly and then pulling through. Just fine. Of course you don't want to slow down too much because otherwise the uh, the AI will end up catching you but um, okay so far so good. Look at that. Fantastic. Good. Okay, I'm, uh, I'm quite enjoying the choice that we made here. That was the lap based, wasn't it? Okay. I'll tell you what, we're, we're going to do this fairly hefty nasty bend race in the same car that we've been doing on the lap based race though we're going to swap if anyone will be able to compete with me today and have a little go I'm on the uh, with the ss form. and see how we get on Okay, nice bendy road again. I think this might even be the one that we raced uh, Tess on, actually, looking at this. Or was it the one that we did our uh, license on? can't quite remember. We have definitely been here before, though, judging by the mini-map. So uh, let's, let's do this here. Down for the bend. 
get the car's momentum going through the bend. This is actually how we're going to have to do the next license as well, is uh, using the car's momentum to get around through the bends and then power on through once you hit the straight. Um, as I say, I've not seen yet as to whether the licenses are easier uh, or the later licenses are easier on the PC or not but certainly on the PlayStation they were nails hard and um, the next license not only has got the down the mountain uh, license test which is horrible but it's also got a two lap race around a track oh Christ that's odd I just lost uh, control of the car there for some reason yeah, it's got a two lap race around a track in the... What is going on here now? Why are we suddenly losing control of the car? Um, and why do I keep interrupting myself? Okay, <laughs> a two lap race around a track in a Dodge Viper, which I'm really not looking forward to. And Stuart has actually got the better of us in this race, all because we kept losing control of the car on some of those very narrow bends which is crazy let's see if we can't take him on this next bend otherwise we may again have to settle for second place and I really don't want to have to do that I should in this car be able to take him on this straight but look he's well away now sorry guys looks like we're taking second on this one Bummer. Wow. Stuart's actually at the top of the leaderboard, which surprises me. Hey ho. Right, okay, we've got a 5.9 mile race here. Let's go. All right. So let's try the Camaro out now. The Solar Crown is now in full swing. Suspense is at an all-time high. Who will win this race? Do you like the noise this car makes? That's fine, Stuart. You can take the lead if you want. Tess, on the other hand, can hop it. Once again, nice bendy circuit. I do like the fact that we can spin our car out, but the uh, AI don't tend to spin out at all which is a bit crazy. they obviously got their training wheels on, haven't they? Get out my way, Stuart. You nonce. <laughs> okay, here we go. You know what they say, if you can't win fairly, Uh, believe me guys, if this was a, an online race and I was racing against you know real people I wouldn't actually lower myself to these dirty tactics it's only because we're going up against um, you know AI So, as I was saying, really not looking forward to the uh, Dodge Viper race, but um, it's got to be done in order to get the license. Again, I'm also n really not looking forward to the Down the Mountain race either. Expect a number of retries on those two license races, because they're horrible. 
for those of you who have played that uh, this game in particular, I wonder whether you might be able to tell me just how hard you found the licenses themselves compared to the races. Is it how I found them, the licenses being harder than any of the other races themselves? Or am I just whinging for no reason and in actual fact the licenses are a piece of pie? I'm sure Flurry's edits will be able to tell me that. Whoa, and yet again, lost control. Very shallow bend, haven't lost control on them before, and all of a sudden we lose control on the bend. We can't let Stuart win, and I'm still unsure as to ouch, how he, he is managing to get in the lead in the car that he's in, because it's, compared to all the other ones, it was, it was one of the slowest cars. <clears throat> you may remember, we tried it out in the shop, and it wasn't all that good. Never understood certain racing games where you know certain cars end up winning perhaps someone can explain that to me how is he in the lead hey he's not he hasn't got a, a special car has he I didn't notice oh dear we're gonna end up taking second on this race are we didn't want that to happen P off, Stuart. P off. Ooh. Wow. Cheap tactics yet again, but I'm taking it because, uh, hell if he's going to take first place. <sighs> Only just. We had to trade paint to do it, but that does put us in the lead now. Wow. <laughs> okay, so here we go then. The final race, we got the eliminator. Let's uh let's get started. I smell heated tires on the asphalt. The tension is mounting for this eliminator challenge. Okay, so we've got basically what looks like just an oval circuit. I'm just going to keep on going round, taking it easy on some of these bends. If I end up having to uh, race dirty again, I will. But by the looks of things, it's a nice, steady round trip. Just ease up on some of these bends to get round. Make sure you don't put too much acceleration into the bend itself. Yeah, like that. And just power on through into the straight. There we go, okay. Wow, well, this is a nice, uh, easy track, isn't it? Oh god. I think I may have put a little bit too much power going into that bend just there. Never mind. There we go. So that's going to be the start of lap four. goes Chris. Here comes, is this lap five? Yep, there we go. There 
it goes Miami. Tessa's going to be next unless she can pull her finger out. Oh, God. We went round that bend a little bit too soon there. That could have been disastrous. Yep, see ya, Tess. Sorry, my lovely. You're out of here. Ryan is going to be the next one out. We've got no problems. Nice quick end to this episode. So that's cool. And there we go, there you have it guys. It's the first half of the A4 Championship complete. We ended up having to take second place in two of the races, but overall we have come first. And that's what it's all about. Fantastic. And we did it with two cars. Stuart is gonna have a heart attack. Our challenger is not leaving him any opportunity. Boom. There we go. So guys, I hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you have, please leave a like. Please comment. I always love to hear what everyone has to say. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Please subscribe. It helps to build the channel. So guys, enjoy those meals. Thanks and good night. Much love. And I will catch you in the next episode. Take care. Bye.